और मैं एक संगठना से यहां पर आया हूं जिसका नाम है पीस मेकर्स इंटरनेशनल यस माय जॉब इज टू हेल्प ब्रिंग पीस एंड यूनिटी और मेरा काम है कि लोगों के मध्य में शांति और एकता को लेकर आए amongst all the believers in Jesus aur wo un logon ke beech mein jo prabhu yeshu masi ke vishwasi hain no matter what color they are chahe wo kisi bhi rang ke kyon na ho no matter what church they go to kya chahe kisi bhi church mein kyon na jaane wale ho no matter what country they live in chahe kisi bhi desh ke rehne wale kyon na ho we are all one in christ hum sab prabhu yeshu masi mein ek hain we are one big happy family hum ek bahut bada ek khushnuma reeliki se rehne wale ek parivar hain god is our father aur parmeshwar hamara pita hai jesus is our lord aur yeshu masi hamara uddhar karta parmeshwar hai and the holy spirit is inside all of us aur parmeshwar atma jo hai hum sab ke bheetar mein hai hallelujah we get excited aur ye ek bahut badi khushi ki baat hai it makes me happy aur wo mujhe bahut khushi milata hai it makes me want to dance aur wo mujhe naachne ke liye majboor karta hai that i finally get to come to india aur jab main parmeshwar ke mahima ke dwara yahan par aa saka bharat mein in see all of you aur aap sab logon ko main dekh paya hu my brothers and sisters in christ mere prabhu yeshu masi mein vishwasi bhai aur behno so hello i greet you aap sab ko main prem bhara vandan deta hu we are family hum ek parivar hain amen amen wow hallelujah how beautiful this all is aur ye kitna khoobsurat hai ye sari baatein okay so when i was riding on the train yesterday aur main jab kal ke din mein train mein yatra kar raha tha I believe that God spoke to me about what to preach here. Aur main vishwas karta hu ki parmeshwar ne us samay mein mujhe mere mann mein bataya ki mujhe aaj aap logon ke beech mein kya bolna hai. I believe that God gave me a message for this church. Aur main vishwas karta hu ki is kalisya ke liye parmeshwar ne ek sandesh mujhe diya hai. IPC Hebron Church Ludhiana. IPC Hebron Church Ludhiana. So the message that God gave me for this church or ek sandesh parmeshwar ne is kalisya ke liye mujhe diya is that this church right here aur wo ye hai ki ye kalisya jo yahan par hai shall never be shaken aur kabhi bhi dagmagayega nahi this church right here ye church jo yahan par hai is going to grow aur wo hamesha badhta jayega there all the seeds that have been planted throughout the years aur ye सालों में जो भी बीज बोया गया है दे हैव बीन सोन इन गुड ग्राउंड बाय फेथ और वो विश्वास के द्वारा अच्छे जमीन पर बोए गए हैं एंड दे आर ग्रोइंग और वो बढ़ रहे हैं इन देयर गन एंड ग्रो मोर और वो बहुत अधिक बढ़ते जा रहे हैं यू कैन एक्सपेक्ट अ बिग हार्वेस्ट और मैं विश्वास करता हूं कि एक बहुत बड़ी कटनी को आप देख सकेंगे यू विल रीप अ बिग हार्वेस्ट ही गो गो एक बहुत बड़ी कटनी प्राप्त होगी Yes, let's give God a hand clap. Our permission to the Father God in the Son. Hallelujah. This church is going to thrive. Ye kalisya jo hai wo badhne ja raha hai. More aur adhik padega. This church will prosper. Aur ye kalisya jo hai badhotri ko prapt karega. More, adhik se adhik. This church is going to grow aur ye kalisya badhega. to the heights that god has called it to grow aur us unchai tak wo badhega jahan par parmeshwar ne usko chuna hai higher and higher and higher uncha uncha aur adhik uncha you're going to go farther and farther and farther aap log aage aage aur bhi aage jayenge in the kingdom of god aur parmeshwar ke rajya mein taking the gospel of jesus christ ye shubhasi ke shubh sandesh lekar all over the planet sare vishva bhar mein There are powerful leaders here. Aur main vishwas karta hu ki yahan par bahut hi samachshali agwa karne wale hain. Miss Suzanne and and her husband and and uh Samson and, and Pastor Jason Koshi back in back in US. Main vishwas karta hu ki Sister Susan ke liye Pastor Koshi ke liye Brother Thompson ke liye Brother Jason ke liye jo US mein hain. The leaders and founders here और वो अगवा करने वाले जो इस सेवा को चलाते हैं वो लोग आर वेरी गॉडली पीपल वो लोग परमेश्वर के चुने हुए लोग हैं दे हैव लेड ए ग्रेट फाउंडेशन 
foundation in this church. और वो लोगों ने एक बहुत बड़ा नींव का पत्थर इस कलिसिया में रखा है. And God is going to bless the work of their hands. और परमेश्वर उनके हाथों के कार्य को बढ़ाएगा और आशीष देगा. He's going to expand them. और उन लोगों को परमेश्वर बढ़ाएगा. And increase them. और उनको और भी बढ़ोतरी देगा. Grow, grow, grow. बढ़ते जाओ, बढ़ते जाओ, बढ़ते जाओ. Higher, higher, higher. ऊंचा, ऊंचा, और भी ऊंचा. More, more, more. अधिक, अधिक, और भी अधिक. More, more, more. अधिक, अधिक, और भी अधिक. Jesus wants to bless you. ईश्वर को आशीष देना चाहता है. John chapter ten, verse ten. जूना की इंजन उसका दस अध्याय उसका दस वचन. Says that the thief comes. वो कहता है कि डाकू आते हैं to steal and kill and destroy जो इसलिए आते हैं ताकि वो आए हत्या करे डाक करे और नष्ट करे but Jesus said लेकिन यीशु ने कहा I come that they might have life मैं इसलिए आया ताकि उन लोग जीवन प्राप्त करें and have it more abundantly और अधिक से अधिक जीवन तो प्राप्त कर सके God has life for you परमेश्वर तो आपके लिए जीवन है He's gonna bless you वो आपको आशीष भी देगा with abundant और उसके साथ में एक भरपूरी का जीवन देगा। Until it overflows, और जब तक कि वो आपके अंदर से उमड़ के बाहर ना जाए। He anointed my head with oil, और उसने मेरे सर को तेल से अभिषेक किया। My my cup runneth over, और मेरा कटोरा उमड़ रहा है। God is gonna overflow blessings for you, परमेश्वर आप लोगों के जीवन के लिए आशीषों को और भी उमड़ देगा। And great blessings are gonna come out of this. And they're going to touch the nation. All of you are blessed. You are in a great place. This is a great church. God is here. And because of that, this church shall never be shaken. Open to Psalms chapter 46. Or a minute south now, we got it, but it's saying that she is. We just have a few quick scriptures to read. Or a quarter of a button, delete the video for a game. But it's saying that she is. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Make sure. Thank you, Lord. Psalms 46, are you there? What is saying that she is up of Mikulia? Amen. Wonderful praise and worship team. Yamare Bohoti Ashish died with worship team. You guys are wonderful. Aplo Bohoti Ashish died Kogu. All of you. Ah, Sablu. Beautiful. Bohoti Kutsu. Okay. Psalms chapter 46. Verses four and five, we will read. But it's saying that she is who's got char or punch with an opening. If Nadi had to speak, Nero say permission in another day or not, but I'm not going to put it on the last time. I don't know what I am. But a picture was never the beach man. What could be the Lega, the Lega, and he will pop for the heat permission was beside the time. Yes, and it like it says in verse five. God is in the midst of her. और जैसे पांचवा वचन कहता है, परमेश्वर उस नगर में, उसके बीच में है। She shall not be moved. वो कभी भी टलने का नहीं। God is in the midst of her. परमेश्वर उसके बीच में है। She shall not be moved. और वो कभी भी डरमाए का नहीं। God is in the midst of this church. परमेश्वर इस कलिसिया के बीच में है। It is only going to thrive. और वो आगे ही बढ़ते जाएगा। It is only going to you are the head and not the tail. आप जो है सर है पूछ नहीं. You are above only and not beneath. और आप सारे अंधविश्वासों से ऊपर हैं. God is in the middle of this church. और मिश्र इस कलिसिया के बीच में हैं. This church is not going anywhere. It's not going to leave. और ये कलिसिया कहीं भी नहीं जाएगा, कहीं भी टलेगा नहीं. But it will stand and be firm and grow. और वो खड़ा रहेगा, ये उसमें मसीह में स्थिर होएगा और बढ़ता जाएगा. Okay, next Bible verse. और इसके आगे एक वचन. Hebrews chapter twelve. इब्राहीम की पत्री उसका बारवां अध्याय. 
Thank you so much for allowing me to come here and speak today. And I am having a I'm having a hard time finding Hebrews. <laughs> Help me. Okay. Hebrews chapter 12. Okay, Hebrews chapter 12, verses 28. It says in verse 28 that we are receiving a kingdom which cannot be shaken. The kingdom of God can never be shaken. Governments of the world will come and go. Other things on this earth will rise and fall. But the kingdom of our God, that this church is a part of, will never be shaped. It cannot be shaped. It's impossible for it to be shaken. It cannot happen. God is on the throne. God is bigger than all. If God be for you, who can be against you? If God be for this church, who can be against it? You guys are standing strong. You guys are a strong army. You are a military that the devil is afraid of. Every time the devil sees you walking down the street, he starts to get worried and nervous. He starts to get afraid. He says, oh no. It's the people from Hebrew church. Oh no. That they are going to hurt my kingdom. They are spreading the love of Jesus. They're being kind to one another. They're helping one another. They're reaching out in love to the community. Oh no, oh no, I know that I cannot stop that. The devil knows that God is much, much bigger. I want you to say, I want you to repeat this with me. Say that God is much, much bigger 